Hey YouTube, this is Rockham the Gamer 81 and welcome to my review of the three Lunar games that I own. The first game we're going to start off with is Lunar, the Silver Star Story Complete for PlayStation 1. I played this game like somewhere when it came out. I couldn't afford the new one because I didn't have enough money. And um, I think this game came out somewhere in like early 2000s or late 90s or whatever but this game was the best RPG um, game I ever played to me how I got into RPGs I was started playing I was watching people playing Pokemon and I was like you know what this is perfect the first RPG I used to play was Fantasy Star but it was not as hard so I gave up on that so we're gonna open up Lunar the Silver Star Story Complete and see what's inside here we go okay Here's the actual game itself. This is not no book. This is a um, the instruction manual on how to play the game and stuff, which also features um, like the character bios and everything. And um, let's see, like I see Nash with his funny looking hair. Do Mia, Kyle, Jessica, right here, and so on. It goes through and. Great fan work, but it never had that much of anything. Good animation, plus, like, villagers and all that. They also have, like, maybe a song that that Luna, uh, Luna sings in the game. Plus, you see the map quests and everything. Like, hometowns, villains, bosses, and all that. Plus... You'll see the actual game itself. It comes with three discs. Okay. This is the first disc. Which is... Um, this is supposed to be... Disc 1. And this is a soundtrack right here. The actual soundtrack for Lunar. Which is a, is a great track to listen to. Because... It has some songs that... That comes from the game, even their songs from the original Sega CD game. Plus, this is the soundtrack. Wait, no, I messed up. My mistake, y'all. This is the making of Lunar. My mistake. My mistake. The making of Lunar it takes you behind the scenes on how the game started. It also talks to the people who made the game, the original Japanese. Uh, artists plus the creators and stuff. This is the music soundtrack. This is the one right here. This is the one. My bad. I know this is a bad um, review. So, okay, please work with me. This is a music soundtrack. And the total time of it is 54 um, minutes and 59 seconds. Here's this two where you see... Um, Luna, aka Althena herself. I'm not even going to explain on how the game works, so you're going to have to play it through. If anyone owns Lunar, then that's cool. Plus, this game also has a map. Map made of cloth. The actual cloth map. I'm going to try to take it out. <clears throat> okay. Right here, this is the map of Lunar. You have towns like Moribia, Saith, Berg, and um, I know there's Vane somewhere, but Magic Guild probably is not on the map. So that's the um, end of part one of this video. So I'm going to skip on to the next game, which will be Lunar 2, the Eternal Blue Complete which is also on PlayStation 1. Now, this game has three discs, a music soundtrack, and it has the making of the game, just like part one. Plus, it has bonus extras, which I'm going to open up for you right now. You have the actual game right here, Lunar 2, the Eternal Blue Complete. You will have disc one. You will have disc two. Plus, you will have... Disc 3, right here, disc 3, 
Sorry, it slips off the thing. You have disc three, and you have the making of Lunar Two Complete, which is the actual behind the scenes, just like uh, Lunar One, the Silver Star Story Complete. The reason why they call it complete because they added more stuff. Now, this game was also on Sega Saturn because only Sega Saturn had the Japanese dialogue. They didn't have the actual. Um, they didn't have the actual. Um, like English version, but there was also, yeah, there was no English version in Sega Saturn. There was no English version in Sega Saturn, but there is a little mini clip, like in the um, game, where you'll see like the actual Lunar Superstar story complete on uh, PlayStation One. You'll see like a little clip somewhere in the game in the in the um, video. So just enjoy watching this. Plus. Here's the music soundtrack for Lunar 2, The Eternal Blue Complete. Now, this is how the inside looks like. You'll see a picture of Hero and his flying cat, um, Ruby. Now, here she is right here. Sorry, you couldn't see it through. Here are the music tracks. You'll have everything to see here. I'm more, um, just get on down with it. So, I'm just going to scroll a notch. And then, um, here is the actual Eternal Blue Instruction Manual. So I'm not going to try to, I'm just going to scan through all this. I'm not going to waste time trying to look at everything. These are the characters you'll have here in this game. You'll have characters like Ruby, Hero, Lucia, who's a mysterious character in the game. You'll have Ronfar. You'll have, um... You'll have Jean Lamina, who's a um, Alsa um, ancestor. You'll have the uh, pirate captain Leo, and these are the villains, except for Nall. So um, Nall was originally from Lunar um, Eternal uh, Silver Star Story Complete. You couldn't recognize him in his human form because he's a he's really a, a flying cat like Ruby. So if you have played Lunar uh, Silver Star Story Complete, you'll know about Lunar 2 after this. So I'm just going to end this, end this part right here. Now, last but not least, we're going to go to the final, final, um, final uh, release. But this time, it's on PSP. Get ready for the world premiere. Now, this is the video I got bad ratings for. So, here we go. Lunar, the Silver Star Harmony. Again, Lunar, Silver Star Harmony. This is the remake of Lunar, the Silver Star Story Complete for PlayStation 1 and Sega CD and Sega Saturn. Now we're going to see what features are in this box. Oh, before I get back to that, I didn't even check the Omaki box. Or no, Omake is pronounced Omaki is in Japanese. Here's some things that's in here. I'll have to skip on that. Okay, don't mind the phone ring, okay? Just, um, here's the map to uh, Lunar Eternal Blue Complete. Here are the little uh, standees of the characters. I'm not going to open this up because I'm trying to keep this in good condition. And here's Althena's um, charm. So, this is the charm, but um, this is how it looks on the box. You might not notice it. I I don't have, um I would open it for you guys, but I will um I will send you the link to the picture of the um charm that she has. So now we can skip on to this page. Now we're ready to show you Lunar Silver Star Harmony for PSP. Time to open the box right about now. Okay, Lunar. These are the bromides. Right here, you got brew mice in this game right here, and um, you will also have see the brew mice are um, characters from different lunar games. Like it comes in many um, different. Um, it will come in different pictures and stuff. You'll see that too. The amazing thing it also has is. Um, the game soundtrack, just like all the other uh, Lunar games, which was so amazing to have, so you can enjoy every track of it, and the actual game itself, along with the 
UMD disc and the instruction manual as usual. So, this is what I wanted to show you. So, I hope you enjoy this vlog. It may not be a good vlog, but at least I did it. I'm just going to just show you the actual game. This is Lunar, the Superstar Harmony. Lunar, Eternal Blue Complete. And you have the first Silver Star story complete. All that in a row. Hope you guys have a nice day. If you guys own Lunar, hit me up, okay? Take care. God bless. Game. Keep gaming, y'all. Rock him out.